two capacitors, six nanofarad and three nanofarad, are connected to a 30 volt battery in this arrangement. Find the equivalent capacitance for this combination and the voltage across each capacitor and the charge on each capacitor. To find the equivalent capacitance, we can use the, this equation we just derived. The equivalent capacitance is C1 plus C2, so we just have to add these two, 6 plus 3, 9 nanofarad. And finding the voltage and the charge in a parallel circuit is not a trouble at all, because we know immediately that every segment gets the same voltage. We already know that the battery has 30 volts. This means that each capacitor also gets 30 volts. Therefore, Q equals to CV. The charge on the 6 nanofarad will be C, 6 nano times the voltage 30 volts. So we get 180 nanocoulombs. The charge on the 3 nanofarad also C times V, 3 nano times 30 volts. So it's 90 nanocoulombs. As you can see, we found the voltage and the charge without using the equivalent capacitance at all. So the 6 nanofarad gets twice the charge because Q equals to CV. When capacitors are connected in parallel, they get the same voltage. That means the one with larger capacitance would carry more charge and they are directly proportional to each other, so the one with twice the capacitance carries twice the charge. What if I ask you to find the charge pumped by the battery? Because the two capacitors in parallel share the total charge from the battery. So it is the sum of these two, 180 plus 90 nanocoulombs. So it's 270 nanocoulombs. And this charge is also the charge on the equivalent capacitor, which means that this is also the CV, the equivalent capacitance times the voltage. The equivalent capacitance is 9 nanofarad times the voltage, 30 volts. So this gives me the same thing, 270 nanocoulombs.